Hey YouTube, I thought it'd be fun to kind of go through my whole collection shelf by shelf. I know I've seen other people uh, on YouTube do these type of videos and I really enjoy watching them. So I thought it'd be fun to do one myself. I've got a, a lot of movies to go through. So I thought I'd kind of break it up into sections. The way I have things organized might be a little bit different than, than most people. I used to have Scream Factory separated and things like that, but I mixed them into the collection because I kind of went more of a, a genre and subgenre route instead. So within my horror, for example, like all vampire movies together, Frankenstein movies together, that kind of stuff. That way, if I want to watch something in particular, I can just go to that, you know, subgenre and and pluck something out and and watch it. So, um, but I thought I'd start with this wall behind me, which I'll give you guys a better look at here. As you can see, it's a big wall, and uh, it'll take some time to do, but. I could do a few shelves at a time and uh, kind of go through it and then uh, give you a little spin here behind me. Um, you can see also there's some shelves we'll go through later as well and I have a closet also. So, But uh, this wall behind me uh, is all horror and so are the white shelves, uh, mostly all horror that are I showed you a second ago. And I still have a few things that are separated out like... Um, for example, uh, I have like shot on video stuff separated out, um, or not shot on video, I'm sorry. Uh, I have some arrow box sets and things like that separated out, but for the most part, um, everything is by like a subgenre, which I really, I'm glad I, I finally settled on that. I know that'll drive some people's OCD kind of crazy because, uh, you know, they're not all together and Blu-rays and DVDs are mixed and all that stuff. But I found that, for example, like a movie like Pumpkinhead, I had, you know, uh, the first two on um, Blu-ray from Scream Factory, but then I had the, the sequels, uh, three and four on DVD, but they were in separate places in my collection. That drove me crazy. So finally they're together and I have all the sequels of films together and there's several that are like that. So, but anyway, uh, without further ado, we're going to, uh, jump in to, uh, this shelf right up there where those pops are. I'm going to take those off. So it'll make that top shelf, but we'll probably do that top shelf. And then that second shelf, see how long they take us and yeah, go from there. So here we go. All right. We are back. And I wanted to show you all also something I didn't point out. I have everything kind of separated with these little tabs here that I've decorated up. So it kind of tells you the different little subgenres I have within uh, my movies. So um, the first one we're gonna start off with is Slashers, which is a pretty big section. It takes up about four and a half shelves here. Um, and I don't have, I need to put a tab up there for that actually, but uh, excuse me while I climb the, the chair here. The lighting's not gonna be great in part of this, but it'll kind of get better as we go. But <clears throat> I thought I'd just pull them out. I won't talk a lot about each movie or anything, but just pull them out and uh, show them to you guys. So, all right, first off here in this corner, we have Abduction 101. Sorry about the glare. Then we have Acts of Death. Next up, let me pull that one out so you can see it better. Uh, All Hallows Eve. Then we have Alone, Ambulance from Scream Factory. And again, these are my own interpretations of things, what I consider slashers. Uh, American Gothic. Next up we have Amsterdam. Sorry, it'll get a little bit easier here in a second once I get past this shelf. Uh, Animal Among Us. And we have Bangin' Vengeance. It's a fun one. Love this movie right here, The Barn. Need the Blu-ray of that one. And we have Berserker. Love this slasher. Billy Club, baseball slasher, good stuff. Black Dahlia. Blood and Lace. And we have Bloodbath from Arrow. Bloodfest, fun one. The Bloodlands. Bloodlines. Blood Runs Cold, really good flick. I, this is underrated, really like that one. Uh, Bloody Homecoming. 
Bloody Scum. These are fun movies. Uh, Bloody Murder and Bloody Murder 2. Then we have Body Parts, cool flick. I always remember the previews for this one back in the day. Bone Breaker, Bone Jangles. This is a fun one. Bones, Snoop Dogg. Borderline Colt, Brutality, Buried Alive, Classic, The Burning, The Butchers, The Bye Bye Man, Cat Sick Blues, Awesome Flick, Chain Letter, Cherry Falls, Good Flick. Switch arms here. Chill Factor. It's a fun one to watch at winter time. Chicken's Blood. Gotta watch that one. My boy Chuck Connery. Clickbait. Broken Lizards. Club Dread. These movies are great. Cold Prey. Cold Prey 2. Awesome Slashers. And then Cold Prey 3, which I, I can't understand because there's I didn't realize there's not an English release I have it but um, it's not in English at all there hasn't been one uh, these are awesome movies the collector and the collection then we have crawl space creeps uh, crush cry wolf good movie I like that one actually curtains fun movie awesome Canadian Slasher, Cutting Class, Young Brad Pitt there, The Dark Hours, Dark House, Dead Above Ground, we have Deadly Manor, arms getting tired, uh, Dead of Night, Dead of Winter, Dead on Campus, Dead Weight, Death to Us Part, Death Pool, I like this one. It's got Cool Duder in it. Death Spa, Death Valley, Delivery, Fun, Pizza Delivery Guy, Slasher, Die Die Delta Pie, Demented. This movie's creep me out because I hate the dentist. The Dentist, The Dentist 2, uh, Derangement. Uh, doll syndrome don't answer the phone we have uh, don't you know what in the woods uh, don't let them in sorry uh, don't go to the reunion doom asylum fun movie dr. giggles and Otis uh, driller killer one of my all-time favorite movies uh, edge of the axe fun one the Evictors, and this Evil Ed. We got Evil Laugh, underrated uh, 80s slasher. If you've never seen it, it's a fun one. Uh, Fade to Black, awesome movie. Uh, the Fan, another awesome movie. And then Fear Farm, I really liked this one from uh, I think last year. Good one to watch at Halloween time. So next up, let's jump down to uh, this next shelf. Okay, this is shelf two here. First up, uh, just go across the things I've got sitting up top because I run out of room. We have the apartment on the 13th floor. Sorry. For the... Then we've got American Fright Fest. We have And Then You Die. And we have Bloodline. Cauldron of Blood. Awesome movie. Cutthroat Alley. Love this one. Hollywood Chainsaw Hookers, another fun one. Descort Service. And then last one we have on the top, Kill Game. Next up here, okay, starting with the shelf. Sorry, it's always hard back in here. We got Final Exam. 
Then we have another final examination. Final girl. Final girls, really like that one. And we have final stab. Foreclosed. This is a really cool movie with uh, Jamie Kennedy. I recommend that one. Plays a creepy dude in that. Freak out. Freaky. I still have not watched this yet. I need to do that. It's on my list. Next up, we have Frightmare. Sorry, just a little bit. We've got F The Fun House. Love that movie. The Fun House Massacre. That one's fun too. Got Garden of Evil. Goreface Killer. Uh, Grave Digger. This one's fun. Halloween movie. Gravy. It's good stuff. Really funny. Greenskeeper. Halloween Night. Really underrated slasher. Definitely check that one out. Great to watch Halloween. Happy Death Day. Love these. Happy Death Day 2. We've got Hashtag Horror. It was not good. Then we've got um, Hatchet Man. Love this movie. I need to get a Blu-ray. Haunt. Hazmat. Heebie-jeebies. We've got Hellbent. This is a great slasher. I highly recommend that one. Hellfest. Love this movie. Hellhole. Hell... Excuse me, Hell Knight. Sorry. He's out there. It's a good one. We got High Voltage. The Hills Run Red. Awesome one. Glad that got a Blu ray. Hala. And Hala 2. Some urban horror. We got Hollow Creek. Home Sweet Home. A Horrible Way to Die. Really good movie. House of Wax, love this remake. About to get a Scream Factory release. The House on Sorority Row. Then we've got Hitcher in the Dark. Hush Little Baby. I Didn't Come Here to Die. I Know What You Did Last Summer. I know What You Did Last Summer. Two, or I'm sorry, I Still Know What You Did Last Summer. And then uh, I'll Always Know What You Did Last Summer. Then we have I, Madman. The Inheritance this is a cool movie. The Invitation, if you like movies, I love movies and malls. Uh, the Intruder, awesome movie. Um, I Saw What You Did, another good one. The Island, it's a crazy movie. Island of Death, Jackals, Jacko, love this movie. Got Linnea Quigley. Next up, we have Jack O' Lantern, Jack O' Slasher, Jack's Back, Jack the Reaper. We've got Jersey Shore Massacre, Just Before Dawn, uh, Killer Campout, Killer Movie, Killer Tattooist, The Killer Work or Killer Workout, fun movie. Killing Ground, another slasher with a night, Nightmare, Knock Knock, Knock Knock 2, Laid to Rest, I love these movies. I think if those have a Blu-ray, I definitely need to pick those up on Blu-ray because I like those a lot. Chrome Skull, Laid to Rest 2, uh, Lake Nowhere, love this movie. The Landlady, fun one. L.A. Slasher, The Lesson, this movie's crazy. Definitely, uh, it's hard to describe, but check that one out if you haven't seen it. So, uh, The Locker, Lost After Dark, everybody knows this one, The Loved Ones, awesome movie. Uh, the Lurker, Maw, um, I was a little disappointed in Maw. I thought it was going to be better. I'm a huge uh, Blumhouse fan. I didn't dislike it, but I expected more from it. Uh, Machete Joe, Madman, fun movie. Maniac, the remake, um, which that should be. Let me fix this real quick. Put that one behind that one. Uh, I liked the remake, but the first one obviously is superior. It's amazing. 
Uh, then we have Maniac Cop, which I love the Maniac Cop franchise. They're so good. Maniac Cop 2 and Maniac Cop 3. And then lastly here for this shelf, we have Mask Maker, which is also pretty cool. So, so yeah, guys, that's shelf one and two. And I think I'm going to stop there for this video, and I will see you guys again soon for another one.